<laughs> Do you see what I see? Have a look at that. Over there. Yep, that's a beautiful crab. There are the three leg rings on that side. And there are a few more on that side. Not going to get a better crab than that. That's beautiful. Oh, there's a claw. Look at that. <laughs> That's beautiful. <laughs> I'm so happy with this one. That is beautiful. It's fresh out the cliff. Yeah. You're not going to beat that. <laughs> That's such a good fossil. And it's going to be easy to prep. Look at that claw already exposed.
if we compare this crab which is much better preserved to this one you can see <laughs> there's quite a bit of crushing damage to it especially if you're looking at this area here that's supposed to be flush over there with the stomach and this one's all weird you can see it's pushed forward like those things should be way down there attached to that section over there and also it's got a broken arm if you look down there there's a crack right through there it should be nice and complete like that one over there <laughs> yeah this poor thing had a had a tough life or a tough last few minutes i wonder what happened to it i wonder if it was an underwater avalanche that buried it and crushed it a bit you see again there that arm's also broken off some more cracks up top here including a very harry potter looking lightning scar over there <laughs> Yeah, and there's, there's big chunks missing here. It's almost like the head got pushed down. Let me know which one you prefer. Do you prefer the ones in the rock, where the rock's kind of like the, the frame of it? Or do you like the one where the rock's been removed, or mostly removed? Well, there you've got a crab where I've removed most of the rock. I've kind of just stopped when the, the legs started falling off. So <laughs> I think that's enough rock removal. Thanks so much for joining me everyone for this crab prep and thanks to those that joined the impromptu live stream. I was testing out the live stream and I got the setting wrong. I set it to public instead of unlisted and suddenly saw 20 people watching it with me and had a bit of a, a panic. <laughs> but it worked out in the end so thanks for joining me everyone. I'll do another one of those soon for the giant crab. Stay safe out there and I'll see you guys on the next hunt.